Hello, my beautiful, beautiful friends. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, my name is Savannah, if you are new here. I thought about doing a build video today, but then when I sat down and was looking at the empty lot, I was like, mm, not really in the building mood, to be honest. So <laughs> let's just film legacy like we always do. But I was gonna film a, uh, I don't know. I was like laying in bed last night thinking about like different videos that I could film. Um, and I was thinking of doing like a five bedrooms, five different aesthetics, kind of build where I'll just make like five boxes on a lot and we'll just build a couple of bedrooms in different styles that sounded really fun to me so um I'll probably eventually be filming that soon but if you guys have any like video suggestions let me know in the comments because sometimes I feel like I film like the legacy episodes too close together I don't know I don't know let me know if you guys mind that or if you want like a couple of days to comment <laughs> so before i make the new episode or if you want to see more cast videos uh, let me know some suggestions for that but yeah we're doing legacy today thank you so much for being here i love you with my whole heart and soul so yeah let's let's get into it shall we all right guys here we are back in the campos household it is the fourth day of spring already that's actually kind of wild, but it looks like our fountains are working. The geese are here. Oh, hold on, this loud. The geese are here. They're out in full effect. <laughs> oh, that's what the, that's floating. Is it? I can't tell, hold on. But yeah, as you can see the lot, it's just a whole different vibe when there's no snow. It just feels, oh yeah, that's definitely floating. That's okay though. <laughs> It just feels so full of life, you know what I mean? It's just beautiful. But anyway, so yeah, in the last episode, we did, we did get some chickens. We got a cow, we got a llama. Yeah, and we're almost done with Sarah's aspiration, her Mount Kamarebi aspiration. I'm pretty excited to finish this one because, what are you doing? Are you making, okay, I don't think that's alcoholic. <laughs> um, uh, but yeah, I'm excited to complete this aspiration because of the reward points that we get, um, worldly knowledge. It's just really cool. Like, it's just like, she's a, a cultured girly, you know? <laughs> but yeah, uh, so after we're done with that one, we're gonna be doing the Beach Life one, which is gonna be really fun. I'm super excited for that one. One of you guys commented that Sarah should meet a mermaid when we go to Solani all the time, and that would be so cool. I don't know if I have any mermaids in my save right now just because it's been so many generations and I don't think I've placed any mermaids lately. So I don't know if they all died out. I don't know if mermaids are immortal, TBH, but if we find one, that would be very cool. Listen, if you're gonna make a drink, you might as well drink it. Am I right? <laughs> Anyways, so Edison is going through a midlife crisis. A lot of you guys were against him getting a job. A couple of you guys said get him a job where he can work from home. Um, and then um, some of you were like, just let the midlife crisis like run its course and he should be fine after that. So yeah, I don't know. He's got one day and 22 hours left in the midlife crisis. I think we should just like let him have it, you know, just work through it. Uh, honestly, I feel, I feel bad, but one of the main things about Edison is that he is a business owner. He doesn't have a job. And I want to keep that part of him true, I think. So, but yeah, he needs he needs some exercise. I think I'm gonna get him to go on a little jog. Um, yeah, he was about to clean up the poop, but like that's the ranch hands job, you know what I mean? Anyway, so the last thing that we need to do for Sarah and her aspiration is to like take it slow and be mindful. Yeah, let's see, when do you have work next? 14 hours? Oh, we need to get your logic skill up to we can wait, we can wait to do that. It is Wednesday at 7.30. Why don't we just like hop right on that? Cause I do want to get started on the beach life aspiration as well. I can't believe we're gonna complete like three or four aspirations with her. And so like young in her life as well, we are actually killing it. These travel aspirations are pretty easy to be honest. If you really like put your mind to it and focus on completing the aspirations, yeah. It does not take that long. I don't know why I always like viewed aspirations as being so like time consuming and daunting in this challenge. I think it's because the aspirations that I normally choose are, <laughs> they're extensive, especially like the, the knowledge ones and the love ones and the, whoa, there is quite the snowstorm going on. Why do you have so many moodlets right now? Drunk? 
What? I thought that it was just a Thai tea that she was making. Oh no. A drunk hike? Probably not a good idea. I just wanted her to go on a mindful walk. Oof. Yeah, if we do make her do that, she's probably going to die. So yeah, why don't you just relax in the hot springs for now, I suppose. Who is here, by the way? We got Jacqueline. Hi, Jacqueline. We got Jeanette, Aurelio. It's always the same people here. I heard he became so much Jordy, he's pretty cool. Yeah, I like his bangs for sure. They're, n they're, n they're nice. Relaxing in a hot spring during a snowstorm. Is it a blizzard? It's literally a blizzard. <laughs> in a blizzard? I don't know, that, that seems kind of fun. Hopefully the blizzard ends soon. Oh my God, look who's here. Eloise. What is going on? Julian Urban. I also haven't used Cupid's Corner uh, with Sarah yet either. That could be kind of interesting too. Where's she going? Browse vending machine. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna make it not a blizzard so that we can go on a meditative walk. <gasps> Ren got promoted to shadow agent. That's so dope. Congrats, Ren. I'm proud of you. So very proud of you. So meditative walk is on this little board right here where you do the hiking. Let me get her in her cold weather outfit really quick. So hopefully this meditative walk will help with her mindfulness. <laughs> she's just in a really crappy mood though. We have to do bonsai tree. Oh my gosh, she just eat shit. Oh, there's more spirits. Oh my gosh, these are the... Make a wish. So yeah, we have to listen to music, view art, read, shape a tree, relax in hot spring, go on a meditative walk. Oh, this poor girl. <laughs> Those little things are so freaking cute. I can't. Oh, nice. The friendly forest spirit seems delighted by Sarah's wish. A strange, powerful flood of magical energy surrounds Sarah, filling her with an overwhelmingly positive aura. I want that. That sounds so nice. An overwhelmingly positive aura. Oh man. Is there any art that we can view in here? Oh yeah, there is. A couple. I'm just like spamming view and listen to the music over and over again. <sighs> this is gonna be really hard. I have a feeling, I just have a feeling. We're definitely working from home today. All right, what are our tasks? Give love advice and watch reality TV. No problem. <laughs> so freaking easy. Oh my God. <gasps> we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. I had her relax in the hot springs, view the art and listen to the music. And we freaking did it, dude. Sarah has explored Mount Kamarebi and taken part in his unique culture. It'll forever hold a special place in her heart. Aww. These Sims are better at socializing during social events. They also enjoy eating food from other cultures and can negotiate a discount at market stalls, which gives them an advantage over other bargaining techniques. Dope. All right. Next up, we've got beach life. All right. So get a suntan, earn gold at a on a kava party and eat a coconut. One of you guys said that uh, <laughs> kava parties are actually a lot harder than it sounds. So, uh, yeah, I'm kind of excited to to see how that goes. So I got this new thing for my phone. If you have a MagSafe phone, it just sticks on with MagSafe. So these are all suction cups and they will literally stick to any flat surface. So like a mirror, a window, uh, a wall, a fridge, literally anything. I wonder if it'll stick on here. Yeah, it actually does. So if you're someone who like likes to take pictures or videos, of like yourself or you with your friends or if you like to watch YouTube and you never know where to put your phone like you just stick it to literally any surface. <laughs> uh, I got it on Amazon. There's a couple of options, but I'm obsessed. I usually have a pop socket on. I love my pop socket. I always have. It's just easier for me to like hold my phone. Um, it like hurts my hand less when I'm watching stuff, but yeah, I've been really liking it. I can like stick it to places in my car too, which has been nice because I don't have like a phone holder in my car. All right, so Sarah, 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 you're exhausted. I'm gonna get you to sleep for a little while. And then once you awaken, we shall get to work. All right, Ren has collected everything from the mailbox. I'm wondering if she got any artifacts to authenticate. 
Yeah, we got two of them. Okay. So yeah, I think honestly, I think that we can like, instead of authenticating them, we can just keep them for our collection. I don't really know how that works, but let's let's get to work on that one. Yeah, one of you guys suggested for the gemstone thing to craft one valued at 2,500. We can like make sure that she's really focused when we do, when we're working on it. I don't know if that would help it at all, but I'll definitely give that a shot. Okay, Edison is super sad from Marnie's death, I, I believe. Jonquilist. I wonder too, if we refine a crystal on the on the table if that would help make it valued more you know dude he has 99 plus robot salvage part why did you steal the skis he straight up stole the rental skis oh my god also let's go down here and i need to make more room for all of the artifacts but yeah, let's put the, the my simi, is that what they're called? Simmies? Let's put these over here. And then these eggs, I believe, are repeats. Yeah, their, their inventories are all so um, just cluttered. I just, they're honestly so hard to organize. <laughs> oh yeah, we need, um, we need a marble jar. Um, yeah, guys, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm so focused on, um, completing these collections because it's literally the last thing that we need to do. <gasps> oh my God. Noelle, she's pregnant. Congratulations. Princeton Bowie. She's having twins. Hold up. That's not your Princeton Bowie. Wasn't that one of Sarah's friends growing up? And is that, that's not your husband. What? Why does it say she's not married anymore? Very unsatisfied. You know what? It's fine. Weird. She, I thought she married Chris Ham. I could have sworn she did. All right, good job, Ren. Mail back. Put in inventory, maybe? What happens if we put in our inventory? Will it count towards the collections? Mm, that one did not. All right, well, let's just mail that back. 4,609, not bad. Who's this? She looks pretty. Jade Pepper, why don't you come introduce yourself? Hopefully she sticks around. Oh my God, they keep sending Ren artifacts. Just nonstop, dude. <gasps> oh my God. Can we just talk about this for a second? This is just ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Yo, why is Agnes around again? Okay, he's getting to her. He's getting there. Hi, how are you? Nice to meet you. Active, cheerful, and proper. Oh my gosh, another proper sim. So There's so many of them. What's that? Oh my gosh, she's telling us gross jokes. I love her. Oh, she's already leaving. Okay. Um, well, that was fast. I don't think she was into us very much. Dude, no way. I don't know who that is. <sighs> Wait, who's that? Stella Darden. I think that's one of your guys' sims too. Hi, Stella. Another Stella, imagine. Whoa, I think that's one of your guys' sims. Is what These sims are too cute to not be your sims. Oh my gosh, she has a book too. Antonia. All right, Edison, come on. Keep introducing yourself to people. Hi, Evangeline. I'm about to eat that cupcake someone left on the bench. Hello? What the? Bro! Oh my god, I can't. Why are you not listening to me? I can't even click on her. I can click on the trash can, but I can't click on her. Ooh. I'm gonna rage. Speaking of rage quitting, how are you guys liking the new Fortnite season? Or chapter? I always get confused on which is which. The new chapter. I think this season is like the bigger one. Time capsule, huh? Let's pop that bad boy open. Okay, it was not anything new. <gasps> this was something new! Oh my God. Yes! Thank goodness. 
Evangeline's calling Edison to check up on him. She knows he's going through a tough time right now. Very sweet. Such a good sister. Oh, just kidding. She's spreading some gossip about Jaden. I don't know who Jaden is, but... Callie Campos. Who's that? Oh, she's beautiful. Who are your parents? William. Yeah, I can see it. I can definitely see it. <laughs> there is a wake. Good morning, my dear. She's gonna go eat some applesauce. Uh, I think she should give her dad some unsolicited uh, advice again. And then we need to watch some reality TV as well. So let's do that real quick. She's cross stitching while watching. She's so cute. Whoa, hold on a second. In the midst of his midlife crisis, Edison has decided rocket science is his thing and wants to do it more often. I mean, makes sense i guess i guess we can go to space some more if you want hey look there's the ranch hand he's oh did he always have a beard i think so but let's give him love advice we need to do it with someone and our dad is exploring space right now and ren is working so <laughs> i how do i get her logic skill up uh i guess we could read a book yay she's finally wearing something new how refreshing. Hello, long time no see. Why haven't you been at the house? We always have a different ranch hand. I haven't seen you though. Hope you're well. Here's some unsolicited love advice in case you wanted it. Oh my gosh, Edison's happy for once. What are you eating? Microwave pastry. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, for sure. For sure, for sure. What is this from? New point of view. Oh, okay, yes. Expert stitcher, hiking homies, adorable. She's so wholesome now compared to before. She hikes and cross stitches and reads. Okay, well, Edison, the reason why I'm having Edison explore space so much is because of the last crop that we need. And there's only one way to get it. <laughs> it's really frustrating, but I'll get it eventually. Oh my God, hold on. She's feeling very focused right now. We should probably, Let's see, what do we got? <gasps> yes, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to refine a crystal. Cut gemstone, mount crystal. Send to jeweler for refinement. Oh, no, no, no. I want Ren to do it. This one is worth 210. That's more than jet. So let's see. Refine. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe refining the crystal before cutting the gemstone. It might make it worth more. Who knows? Pet black rooster. Oh my god, you're cute. Okay, keep going. Sarah's eating applesauce and then she's gonna go play with her chickens. It's the cutest thing ever, honestly. Ooh, what do we got here? Oh, this is one of my favorite things to see me. <laughs> Stella made a fruit cobbler. She's so adorable. I love her so much. Thank you, Stella. That looks amazing. Don't you, don't you dare think about eating it. She refined the crystal. I honestly don't even know. I don't even know if you can cut a gemstone with a refined crystal. I guess we'll find out. Oh, you can't. That sucks. Oh, well, I tried. Okay, she cut the gemstone. 1,237. How the heck? How do I do it? This is ridiculous. All right, well. It's just telling me to keep doing it. Keep on cutting a gemstone with the gnome and just hoping, just praying to God that eventually it'll be worth that much. We have so many people on the lot right now. Patchy's awake, the gardener's here, the ranch hand's here. I think the maid is here as well. <laughs> all right, so it's Friday and we already completed all of our work from home assignments. And then we have Saturday and Sunday off. So I vote that we go and stay the weekend in Solani and work on her aspiration a bit. But first, let's go to the night market real quick and see if we can find any tassels. Oh my gosh, yes, there's a new marble here. Let me grab that one. Oh my God, that one's $200. Imagine paying $200 for a marble. I'm also gonna get a jar. Um, I swear they always have light green and pink tassels. Never anything else. Okay, let's dig in this sand pile and hope for the best. Yeah, baby! Magenta tassel. Let's freaking go. Oh my gosh, I'm so stoked right now. All right, let's do this frog one. And then, is there any other dig spots on the beat? Oh, we could totally sneak into the sanctuary again and hope that we get 
the lost and found one because that worked out really nicely last time. We were, we were able to get a tassel from that. Dang it, I should have got her some food at the night market. Oh, I think we have some avocados in our inventory that we can eat. Yes. <gasps> we did it! We got the lost item one! Yes, claim to be looking for a lost item. Oh, we got a blue tassel. Dang it, we literally already have that one. Oh well. Okay, eat your avocados, my girl. That should fill you up. Okay, explore the cave. How many more tassels do we need, though? Four more! Not bad. We got a red tassel just now. Why do I feel like we haven't had that one? We don't have- we- Oh, yep, that one's new. It was a rare one, too. Let's go. All right, keep going. Keep exploring. Another red tassel. We've gotten five red tassels from exploring this cave so far. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Give me something new. Oh, well, it's fine. Okay. Um, Let me see. What shall we do now? I don't know of any other ways to get tassels. I wonder if you could trade them with people. Is that a thing? Oh, we could probably fish them out as well. It looks like we are no longer banned from the sanctuary either, so we can visit it. And we can also adopt a tiger if we want to. I don't know what that does, but I vote that we do it. Congrats on becoming a Cub Club member and thank you for your generous donation towards the Adopt-A-Tiger program. Every cub needs a fluffy friend, so be on the lookout for your plush buddy and an exclusive commemorative poster. This will arrive by mail in one or two business days. Aww, your contribution is helping tigers thrive in and out of the Sulea Tiger Sanctuary. That's awesome. She's in a really bad mood, so I'm probably gonna send her home soon, but okay, no luck. I visited it like four or five times and no dice. But yeah, let's go home. Let's get our mood back up and then head to Solani. Should I bring the whole family or should it just be Sarah? Maybe just Sarah so that we can focus on her and not have to worry about the needs of anyone else. You know what I mean? All right, so let's just get a potion of plentiful needs just to like make it fast. Thank God it worked this time. This cloning machine can be so finicky sometimes. Like you'll make get these rudimentary matter cubes instead of getting another potion. So annoying. All right. Oops, what did I just do? I wonder, can I take a vacation from the travel menu? Because I just accidentally clicked the travel menu. <laughs> uh, okay, so we're going to be going to Solani. Do I even have a rental in Solani right now? I don't. Gosh darn it. I'm wondering if we even need a rental or if we should just like go and stay and chill. Okay, yeah, let's just go. All right, so this is the new beach that I placed from the gallery. Uh, it was one of the more popular ones when I looked for like a beach, um, a beach replacement. Oh, it's honestly super cute. I'm in love, I'm obsessed, so adorable. Uh, so the first thing on our list is to get a suntan. So sunbathe in, oh my God, should we sunbathe in the nude? Do you think that would be something that she would do? <laughs> I don't know, but I'm doing it. Screw it, right? Yeah, this beach is so gorgeous. Um, hello? Did I tell you to stop? Practice making drink? No! Come on before the sun goes away. Oh, look! Evangeline and her husband are here. They are so cute, you guys. I love them. They are just so happy together. Edison, he's like, where'd you go? <laughs> when you coming to visit, bro, we literally live together. Whatever. I've been gone for like 20 minutes. It is sunny out. I wonder how long it takes to get a suntan. Also, who's this? Lauren Landgrab. Oh no, pass. Hard pass. Oh no, the sun's gone. Oh? <laughs> Why are we glowing red? Are we getting burned? Oh, it worked. Nice, nice. What the? Look at her picture. <gasps> Holy cannoli. What happened? She turned into a completely different person. Oh, good grief. Okay, let's just... <gasps> Guys, help, help, I'm so scared. How do I get it off? How do I reset? <gasps> no! Perfect tan. Okay, what if I get rid of that? Oh God, no. Oh God, no, 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 no. I didn't know suntans broke your sim. <gasps> okay, good, she's back. She's back. <sighs> Who's this? Oh, he's Bob Bowie. Dang it, he's freaking family. Mm, 
Okay, it's fine. Eat a coconut. Okay. Where do I find a coconut? Wait, what's in here? Buy beach supplies. There might be a coconut in there. Okay, we got a bunch of loungers. A towel. Oh, there it is. One coconut, please. Thank you. God, that was so scary, guys. I thought she was broken forever. I really did. Do you guys get that glitch too with suntans? Cause, mm -mm. not for me. Eat the dang coconut, my girl. What is the issue? Oh my God, no, don't break in. What, why can't you eat the coconut? Is it cause you're in the water? Oh, there you go. That is not how you eat a coconut, but I'll take it. Earn gold on a kava party. Are seashells a collection? It is. Chat with Jamie. Who's Jamie? Oh, hello. <gasps> She's gorgeous. Why are you sad, Jamie? Don't be sad. They have good compatibility. She's a young adult. Freegan. Ooh, is this our Solani Bay? Is it? She likes fitness. Okay, we like fitness too, I think. Shoot, I don't even know. Art lover. That's lovely. Okay, a freegan and an art lover. Oh my God, Evangeline and Jamie are still there, dude. It's been hours. Are you single though? That's the real question. Wow, they're getting along really well. You know they are when you hear them talk like that. Aw, <laughs> look at Leland. Him's here with the girly pop. Marissa Campos. Oh my God, did you get married? Aw, he's so handsome. Look at those eyes, my goodness. Who are you? Luz, can you go away? Luz? Whoa, who's that? Brendan, oh, okay. <laughs> Turn ons, hipster fashion, blue clothes, yellow clothes. Turn offs, brown clothes, purple clothes. Oh, she's self-absorbed. Okay, interesting. Um, I really wish that the clothes thing was not a turn on or a turn off. Like who honestly gives two craps about what color their clothes are? And that seems to be the only thing that pops up when you ask Sims about it. Okay, well, the next thing we need to do is have a kava party. So, oh my God, Kyle Kyleson, is that a real Sim? Is this a real person? I, I feel like that name is way too planned for it to be a random townie. <gasps> a mermaid, a mermaid, a mermaid. Who is it? Brittany Tinker. Dang it, it's an elder though. Okay, it's fine. We'll keep our eyes out for another, another one. I'm gonna get her to go home. I think in order to have the kava party, we should probably place a rental and uh, have it there. I think that would make the most sense. We can bring the whole family. Maybe uh, Sarah took a beach day to herself and then was like, yo, this beach is so beautiful. There's so many cool people. Let's get a rental. Let's go for one night. <laughs> so we can pretend that she's going home to pack a bag and to come back. All right, we're back home. I did place a lot. I will show you, actually, let me just show you now. This one by Emma. La Thea. It's called Kava Party Beach House. I placed it and I made it a rental. Take a vacation. We're going to bring everyone. We should also bring that person that we met on the beach, Jamie. Eloise. Other Jamie. I think I've only ever done a Kava Party one time before and that was in my was it my island living rags to riches? I honestly don't remember. Oh man. Yeah, I don't know if you guys recall, but I did place my Island Living Rags to Riches family in this save file. And uh, Lilo did open like a gallery of some sort. I don't really remember what it was. I think it was painting, um, but the gallery is in this save file too. We should totally go and look at it. All right, we're here. Oh shoot, I brought the horse. Gosh darn it. How do I send it home? Send home. Sorry, Dolly. Why, why can't I send you home? Dang it. <sighs> okay, it's fine, it's fine. Everything's fine. Okay, so here's the little rental. It's pretty cute. Uh, the creator made it specifically for kava parties. Wow, look at all the fish over here. This is crazy. Let's see if we can get any for our uh, collection. Also, Ren, why don't we get you in a different outfit? <laughs> 
Ask Ren to mentor. Oh, that's dope. Okay. I also hate that the ranch hand. Oh my god. I always hate that the ranch hand it goes everywhere we go to. Doesn't make any sense. You dislike fishing? Okay. Oh my god, what are these? What? Moodlet solver? Dude, whoever made this put moodlet solvers on the bar. That is so sick. <laughs> I love that. Who are you and why are you in this house? Bald, pantless, no one even invited you. Please leave. Oh my god, he's barbecuing steaks as well. Sheesh, not the air guitar. Tech guru, no thank you. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and start the kava party. We might as well have it during the day. This is actually really nice. Steaks, drinks, vibes. <laughs> All right, kava party, where are you? There we go. Goals and rewards, yes. Um. All right, okay. So we need to socialize and invite guests to drink kava. Are those seriously the only things that we have to do? That's actually insane. Who put metal on, I wonder? Imagine a seductive dance to metal. <gasps> what just happened? Oh my God, why do people keep coming on the lot? That guy's, oh, I thought he was swimming in a hoodie for a sec. Guest? I didn't invite you. Do people just show up if you have a kava party? Call to grab drink. Yes, yes. I wonder what kava tastes like. Grab a drink. Okay, we gotta do it three times. All right. Oh, we did it. Make a kava toast? How? How do I do that? With a cup of kava, select another sim and then friendly toast. Okay. Kava toast. There we go. Okay. Easy. <laughs> Make a group meal? Oh my god. Okay, yeah. This is definitely a little harder than I thought. What should we make? What happened to the girl we invited? She just disappeared. Oh my god. Poor Dolly. Let me just make you happy because I don't know how else to like... Oh, okay. I don't know how else to take care of you when we don't have the means here. Okay, call to meal. She made rice cake. What is this? Inspiring role model from someone nearby. Relaxed from drinking kava, feeling fulfilled. You have to make another group meet. Are you kidding? Holy crap. Okay. Well, I have to have everyone dance at the same time. So how I do that is I just like click on Sims and add them to my group. Oh my God, she's, she's drunk. I add them to my group and then you just click on the thingy and you do dance together. Pretty easy. Oh, we got gold already. I mean, yeah, that was definitely a little bit harder than I thought. Do we like Jamie? Maybe we should start flirting with her since we're a little, we're a little lady five fitty. She looks sad. I think she had a death because the console about death option keeps coming up. It's so pretty here. I, I can't ever get over how gorgeous Solani is. I really can't. Oh my God, she's passing out. <gasps> no! Oh my God, you poor thing. Okay, well, come up here and sleep it off then. I'm sorry, I worked you way too hard. <gasps> Edison's midlife crisis has passed and he's going through a resolution phase, reflecting on who he is and where he is in life. Okay, well, good. I'm glad you're past it. I really am. It's not so bad. Edison has made it through a life-changing experience and has realized things aren't as bad as originally thought. Edison might not be the same sim they were before this life event occurred, but he is at peace with this. Aww. Evangeline, what is wrong? I feel like she's just not in a good place right now. She's sad all the time and very antisocial. But I know that her and Jamie are like, fine. We witnessed it. We witnessed it at um, the at the beach. They were cuddling, watching the sky. 
<gasps> Ren has reeled in a royal saber fish, an endangered protected species of fish. Keeping this fish is illegal and could result in consequences. What are the consequences? It is part of the collection. What are the consequences? I need to know. I can't find anything on Google about what happens if we keep it. I know a lot of you guys are going to disagree, but I'm scared that we're not going to be able to get it for the collection, so I'm going to catch it anyway. Okay, can we release it when it's in our inventory? No. Ugh. Amazing catch. Oh, she's also super sad about the fishing. Oh no, everyone's pissed at her. Are those the consequences? Everyone is giving her shit. Oh my god, I can't. I'm sorry. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, maybe you should stop fishing for now. I guess I don't blame them. I probably would have done the same thing. So the consequences for catching a rare fish are everyone hates you after. Got it. All right, I'm gonna end this. We did get gold, so um, yeah, perfect kava party. Let's go. All right, what's next? Find things beachcombing, grill, barbecue, or roast food five times. All right. And then find things beachcombing 10 times. What is this birthday cake? Oh, host masterpiece. Nice, good job, girl. What the heck is a gummy guppy? Don't tell me it's made out of candy. A deliciously squishy friend. Wow, I kind of want to put that in the in the freaking fish tank. Look at her go, she's catching all the fish. How many more do we need? Just a few. 17 out of 22 plus 11. Oh my God, so many that I want the bat fish. Yeah, the fishing collection is gonna be very difficult. What is this? Royal saber fish? Okay, release. Oh, wait, dang it. Releasing it would have counted towards the collection anyway. Well, that's good to know. Another one. All right, well, I would say that was pretty successful. I think, I think we'll just stay here for a little while longer, but I am going to end this episode here. And the next time that I film, We'll keep on going. We got to do some beach combing and we got to do some grilling five times. I am currently working on the fish collection, the tassel collection, the marble collection, the seashell collection. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're trying to get as many done as possible. Oh, nice. We found a heart of Solani. What do these do again? I don't even know. I think it's just a decoration, but Wait. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, leave me comments. Let me know what you think about uh, Jamie here. I don't know if this is one of your guys' sims, but um, yeah, she's pretty. I, I need to fix my lashes. I need to make a note of that because all my sims be looking crazy. The fact that she even has lashes on is kind of an indicator that it might be one of your guys' sims. But, um, I don't, I don't know, I'm not sure. Whoa! This is picture worthy, 100%. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, let's have a look at the calendar as well and see what we got coming up. <gasps> don't tell me. Oh my gosh. Edison's birthday is in one, two, three, four, five days. Sarah's birthday is in six days. Holy cannoli, Edison's gonna be an elder. That means Evangeline's gonna be an elder too. Whoa, that came really, really fast, guys. And Sarah's gonna be an adult. Are you kidding me? What level is she in her career? Six. Okay, it looks like she's gonna get promoted as well. So we need three more promotions. We'll finish this beach life aspiration and then give her the super parent aspiration and get to work on having some kids. <laughs> I can't remember the last time we've waited until adulthood, like proper adulthood to start having kids for this challenge. It's been kind of nice though, just focusing on aspirations and things like that instead of focusing on like kids. She looks so stoked. Oh my, oh my God, not the thumbs up. Oh my gosh, help me, I need a picture of this. <laughs> All right guys, as always, leave me comments. Let me know what you think. I love you so much. Thank you for being here and I will see you in the next one. Bye.